Hi guys, today we're going to talk about Prince Harry. We're going to talk about the situation regarding his, uh, not his visa, but the form that he filled out when he was on the plane to the USA. As you know, when you take a plane to go to the USA, to travel to the USA by air, you're given a form to complain. And on that form, you have to specify whether or not you had taken drugs prior to to coming to the USA sometimes in your life. And as you know, Prince Harry said in his book that the spare that when he was younger, about 20 years ago, he tried some of the drugs. So the Heritage Foundation run by a grotesque man who is linked to the royal family, who's a fan of the royal family, had decided to request that information to Washington, D.C., the immigration department there, in order to see what Harry had ticked, right? And... For some reason, he's doing that right now. So far, his request for that information had been rejected. He fought to bring that in front of a federal judge, and his request has gone through. He will be able to present his case in front of a, a federal judge sometimes in February. It's actually on the 23rd of February. So this guy was gloating about that, about the fact that he was able to, to get a judge to listen to his arguments and try to get that information. So far, Washington, the Homeland Security Department, has said that it was private. By releasing that information, it would breach Prince Harry's right to privacy. But they say that Prince Harry breached his own right by revealing that in the book. The funny thing is, it was already reported in the press that Prince Harry had taken stuff and this happened about 20 years ago and between 20 years ago and now prince harry has gone to the united states at least four or five times why wasn't this heritage foundation upset then so curious about what he had ticked right this is because prince harry was under the uh, the umbrella of the royal family and that guy which name i don't want to give here wasn't interested in knowing anything about about it. Now that he has cut all ties with the royal family, this guy is just uh, petty, right, about about that. So anywho, we're going to wait and see what's going to happen in February and we will see. Let me know what you think. Hope you liked the video. Feel free to click on like if it's the case. Subscribe for more videos and click on the notification bell to be notified when I post a new video. Thank you.